Hi my YouTube friends! Uh, so today I want to speak about um, what uh, fragrances you know I would like to buy in the future and also which fragrances do I miss as well. So uh, basically recently I threw out like empty bottles of my uh, fragrances that I liked so much so uh, fragrances that I would like to buy uh, again is um, uh, Chanel uh, Eau Fresh, uh, Chanel Chance Eau Fresh. That's the name. It's like a that uh, kind of greenish bottle, you know. So that one I will miss a lot, and um, it's quite worth spending money on this fragrance. Uh, and then after also I miss so much uh, just finished the bottle and threw it out it's uh, Molecule 04 uh, it has this amazing Yavanol uh, smell and uh, I just threw out that empty bottle and I just like really think that I will miss it so much and uh, probably I will have to buy it again in the future and then also I will miss Molecule 03 because it had that uh, very fresh vetiver and uh, it's like, you know, it's just, um, it's just amazing, you know. I think I will really miss it so, so much. And also, like, the fragrance that I have never tried, uh, in, it's not like never tried, but uh, like I never bought it uh, in, in the past. So I would like to get in the future, even though it's so, so expensive, uh, that would be Le Labo, another 13, uh, and Le Labo, Santal 33. It's just because so many, so many people are talking about it, and uh, just so many controversial opinions, and uh, it's, just, uh, it's just so expensive. But I smelled uh, Le Labo, another 13, on, on one woman and just uh, it just left me really fascinated about that smell and um, and um, uh, I will always keep on buying and I just bought it recently as well Molecule 01 that one I will always keep on buying and then there is also some other recommendations that I got from my uh, you know from uh, one girl told me that you know, there is that uh, next to the, or how is it like, a, I think it's Baredo, Baredo walking, walking in the beach or something like this. And also there is another one like next to the fire, firewood or fire, whatever, like, so those type of, I just, it's not like I would buy it, uh, but I would like to try to see what is that fuss about, you know. Uh, and then, uh, let me see, uh, I think there are so many, many perfumes that would interest me, you know, to get it. Um, I think this um, Armani Fiori, I think it's quite nice to have as well. I mean, if I would be a rich woman, you know, I would probably uh, would not, uh, you know, just doubt and I would just buy it and have it and enjoy it, you know. And that and uh, let me remember more. It's probably all that I would like to kind of, you know, have. Of course, I would like to have all other fragrances, but like uh, we are not able, you know, to afford to buy all the fragrances that we see, you know. So just keeping everything economic, uh, I would say, uh, I would like to try Le Labo another 13 and Le Labo Santal 33 and also to, to buy again those molecule fragrances because they are so good. So, so that's all what I would like to say. Like if you uh, like are uh, thinking to buy some kind of fragrance for sure, like let me know. Uh, I will be interested to know what fragrance is on your mind, you know. I know one of my subscriber, Annabelle, like she really recommended me this Samsara, you know, Samsara fragrance and that one I would like to try uh, to smell first, but I just cannot find it in the shops. So, so there are basically 
many many uh, fragrances that we have to try through life and uh, what will be our experiences like with each of them it will be different so well uh, that's all that i would like to say to you i will come back to you with another fragrance and bye bye